is stepping up to help the people in Goshen with a major need. WCPO 9's reporter Jessica Hart is live there now with how they plan to give a helping hand this weekend. Good morning, Jessica. Hey, Chris, and good morning. Yeah, Crossroads Church is having free child care services today from 9 to 1 for families to drop off their kids. And I'm actually outside Goshen High School right now where people have dropped off dozens of water bottle cases here. And inside the high school is a storm shelter for people to come and get some rest. Volunteers are also cooking food, but the shelter is still in need of some more non-perishable food items. Township Administrator Steve Pegram says a lot of people got their power back last night, but adds thousands of Duke Energy workers are still making repairs. However, there are some people who still can't get into their homes. My cousin Joyce has six kids um, and they're in a house with a tree completely through the roof. So I don't think they're going to be able to get back in it for quite some time. People are meeting at the high school here today for a volunteer cleanup event. They'll be removing debris from houses near the fire station. So if you'd like to join, you can come down here right now. They're meeting right now to discuss where they're going to start because they have to stay out of the way of Duke Energy workers and again, if you want to drop your kids off while you come volunteer, you can drop them off at Crossroads East Side. In Goshen, Jessica Hart, WCPO 9 News.